sound of Rufus's motorcycle could only mean one thing. The Bobcats are rolling into the new season. But tonight, Ohio played for its Bobcat. OU hoped to give Rufus a birthday present with a week one victory over the Florida Atlantic Owls. It looked like the Owls were playing party crashers early. Miami transfer Nicolsi Perry drops a dime into the outstretched arms of Jaquan Burton as FAU leaped out to a 7-0 lead. But this felt like a new Bobcat team who was always ready to throw the counter. After a pair of field goals, redshirt junior Curtis Rourke finds his man Sam Wegloose over the middle as the Bobcats nodded up at 10. Head coach Tim Albin was thrilled with the leap Rourke took tonight. And so you just could just tell in the conversations, good or bad, that he is um, going to take off. So we're very excited with his play along with many others. In 2021, one of the biggest problems for the Bobcats was finding the big play. But tonight, quarterback Curtis Rourke had no trouble doing that. He opened up the field for the Bobcats for huge chunks of yards. And for Rourke, he said it came down to trusting his teammates and trusting himself. We've had those plays called in the past and stuff like that, but the execution wasn't there. And um, we really put an emphasis on making sure we can get those big plays to, to balance everything out. It was a career night for Rourke. The Maple Missile torched the Owls for 345 yards and four touchdowns. Two of those TDs came in the third quarter as the Bobcats played their best ball in those 15 minutes to take a 27-17 lead into the fourth. You make your biggest jump from your first game to your second game. We've got nine super seniors, 23 other seniors. I said, gentlemen, we're making it right now, uh, beginning in the third quarter. We're going to make our jump. We're going we're to play our best football in the second half of this game. Perry was desperately trying to keep FAU in this one, storming back to cut the Bobcats lead down to three. But the Owls had one more chance to make things interesting. Fourth and ten, but Roman Parity was there to break it up, and the Bobcats make a statement with a 41-38 victory. For Bobcats Showcase, Week 1 dub, let's go. I'm Aiden Crowley.